Hi, uh, I'm Céline Bourri. I'm the head of Middle East, Africa and Asia Pacific for uh, Airbus Secure Land Communication. Uh, it's a pleasure to have uh, you with us here today at the Dubai Air Show. So I'll be talking a little bit about our uh, Tactilon Agnet solution. So the name first, uh, Tactilon, is really coming from the tactical operations networks. And Agnet is really about uh, being agnostic networks. The solution is really not uh, related to a specific technology, but the aim of it is really to be able to be completely agnostic, being a 4G, 5G, uh, Tetra, or any wireless network behind it. And that's really the beauty of it. Great. So uh, thank you so much, first of all, sir, giving your precious time to us at Dubai Air Show. I hope the show has been very good till now. So uh, tell us what are the salient features of uh, Taclinon Agnet that gives you an edge over the market? So um, Agnet solution is really a solution that we have now running in the region since a couple of years. It is really the most advanced uh, uh, mission critical uh, application being for voice, for messaging, for video and much more And that. It's being used now uh, since some years in Saudi Arabia, in UAE and in Qatar mainly for public safety and first responders. And what we are doing here for the Dubai Air Show is we are also now pushing a new module of Agnet that is called Agnet Aviation, that is really dedicated to uh, airports, airlines, uh, ground operation management, but also uh, overall optimization of the process that are around an aircraft. Being an aircraft for the airlines, being an aircraft for the airport. And this is something brand new that we are developing. So we are bringing the security and the availability of the public safety part. We are introducing new models and new functionality that are linked to uh, aircraft ground operations. Because as you may know, Airbus is providing the best aircraft of the world. So this is a natural evolution for Agnet. Right. Um, we read about uh, the very successful uh, Hajj uh, uh, project that uh, where Tactilon Agnet was uh, deployed and uh, it was very successful in Mecca. So do you have anything very specific planned for UAE, some project like that? Yeah, so we are very proud of what we did with Hajj. We've been supporting Hajj now for uh, more than uh, five years, uh, providing always a critical communication for public safety and first responders. And absolutely, we are doing here the same in UAE. As a matter of fact, we are providing all the critical communication for Dubai Air Show uh, right now. So everything that is behind the scene for critical communications is based on uh, Airbus SLC solution, communication, messaging, and organizations. And we will be also supporting one of the best, one of the biggest show that are arriving just after, which is a, a Formula One in Abu Dhabi. So we are really always behind the scene here in UAE, and we are extremely grateful for UAE government for trusting us to be there. Uh, a partner of choice for critical communication and security behind the scenes. Great. Uh, Mr. Bori, you talked about uh, your solutions being provided for civil and commercial till now. Can you talk to us about the military implications, the military uh, expertises that you have? We've been supporting also uh, MOD's organization since uh, many years, so being the MOD here in UAE, but also uh, uh, in Saudi and different other countries. So we provide also the same level of solutions for communications and tactical operations. Specifically, we have now a brand new solution that we introduced during the JITEX here in Dubai, which is the tactical bubble. This is something dedicated to uh, uh, tactical operations and tactical intervention in the field. So we support that, obviously. And what we can do also, uh, being part of a bigger group, uh, Airbus Defense and Space, we allow also the integration of uh, our Agnet solution with uh, other solutions from, uh, from our, uh, our colleagues from other public, uh, from other divisions. So we integrate Agnet, for example, with uh, satellite secure communications for military satcoms. Uh, we can integrate that also with different other solutions around space and intelligence. So the, the, the key advantage of, of Agnet as of today is really an of SLC solution. It's not only SLC, it's really the capability of integrating with all Airbus uh, portfolio. And Agnet, as a matter of fact, is the gateway to access Airbus digital portfolio, being the military uh, portfolio or the civilian portfolio. Right. Now we will uh, narrow down it more. About the market, uh, you must be having competitors for the same kind of uh, things are being featured. Uh, how is Tactical Agnet stands out among its competitors? So we do have competitors, but competitors are actually specifically focusing on certain areas. So we have competitors for the push to talk port only, we have competitors for different things, uh, different models. But the beauty of Agnet is actually uh, the fact that we can integrate more than one functionality. So today you will not find any other solution in the market that will bring you all of it all together. So being the uh, voice part, the data part, but also integration with uh, satellite part, intelligence part, and 
all the portfolio around it. So uh, on a specific features, point by point, you may find other solutions, but all of it together, including now the new aviation module, there is no other one in the market today offering these solutions, and we are extremely proud of that. Great. Now, every product, when it has been deployed at different regions, according to that region, uh, it needs some customizations. So, what about tactically? Uh, for UAE region, what have been the customizations that are you have been done? So, uh, we've been we've been working in UAE with uh, with several partners. So one of the first users of Agnet in, in UAE have been actually Abu Dhabi Police with whom we are working on several customization for them. We are working also with NIDA in, uh, in Dubai, where we are doing specific customization, and I forgot to mention that when you were talking about events. Uh, Agnet uh, today and our solution is also uh, used to support the uh, Expo, mm -hmm. so Dubai Expo 2020. Uh, so if you walk around in Dubai Expo and you see security people, just ask them and you will see that they will have a, a different solution from Airbus, they will have the, the Dabat. Uh, they will have Agnet and different things. And uh, we actually have a team here in UAE that is a business analyst that are dedicated to customize the solution, to integrate it with specific solutions from the customers in UAE. We are working, as a matter of fact, right now with a key uh, airport in the region to customize uh, Agnet for aviation for them and hopefully make them the the launch customer for this solution. So can you, very soon can you we'll tell have us more news. about specific about these customizations? What exactly on the technical terms? So customization, it will be different topics. So it will be uh, developing. So the minimum will be actually to customize the solution, so it will have the exact same look and feel as the business application of the customers. Mm -hmm. If you see Agnet for Abu Dhabi Police, you come with Abu Dhabi Police logo, so you won't even know that it's Airbus behind it. Mm -hmm. uh, we integrate also specifically for airlines for dedicated uh, network operation they have. Mm -hmm. Uh, we can integrate to their specific tools, to their specific process. So behind the scene, it may always be the same Agnet core, but every customer will have his own Agnet on his network, with his applications, with his logo, and is in terminals. That can be either Tetra, can be a hybrid, can be even satellite in some case. So uh, the whole idea about Agnet is make it unique for every customer, and some of the leaders here in terms of customization are actually in UAE. So we're very proud to support them. Lastly, how has been GAS till now for you? After Very COVID, good. it's a uh, great yeah, thing. Yeah, absolutely. It's so good to uh, to have uh, to see so many people, to see our traditional customers, to see new customers, new prospects. And, uh, and having this interview in live, last time it was by Zoom, so it's very yes. nice to, uh, to have the chance to meet people again. This is the first air show post-COVID. Uh, we have made some very nice announcements, I'm sure you will see them on the press. And uh, it's just the beginning, so looking forward for more announcements in the next hours. Thank you. We wish you all the best, and uh, the days remaining for the DS, I'm sure things will be great. Thank you very and, much. And uh, we will be out of this crazy situation after all. Thank you so much for your time, Mr. Murray. Thank you.